Hey, tell me something more. Which is most important for your character, Oliver? Yeah. Uh, to be alpha, to be loyal to the pack, or to be the most powerful werewolf? No, alpha and loyal to the pack. I think all of his choices were directly for that, for the pack. Mm. That's what I do believe for his character. It was probably easy to think that he wanted to be just powerful. You know, there was a scene that you guys didn't get to see. I don't know if you've seen it on we YouTube. It, yeah, the cut scene between him yeah. and Jackson. Yeah. And a lot of people think, and that was so fun to film, and I wish they put that in, but they didn't. But it, a lot of people will think he just wants to be the strongest, the most powerful one. He just wants the rings. We have to remember, and you saw it in Vampire Diaries as well, like mm -hmm. the whole having to change on the full moon, the painful process of it. Like when uh, Michael Trevino's character, mm -hmm. Tyler, he did not want to change. He did not want to change. So getting to be a hybrid was a blessing, which is why I remember there was Sire de Klaas and all that. To get back to the point of your question, though, we wanted the rings because we wanted to be able to control our fate. We didn't want to have to go through this painful process. And so Oliver's choice to do this for the pack was for, that was one of the many reasons to, for his back, the loyalty for his back. Mm. So that's what I think. Probably. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. And if you had, if you had a choice, I believe uh, during the auditions, uh, you you have auditioned for different yes. uh, roles. I don't know. Yes. What would you choose if you had a choice to choose a werewolf, a vampire, or a witch, a or a hybrid? I don't know. I, would, I was just telling her that like I would probably break all the rules, and I would want to be a combination of everything. A which zombie. Oh. <laughs> some, like, some, yeah, zombie. Stronger than Klaus. <laughs> Stronger than everyone. No, yeah. just, I mean. If I could choose, it's a world that you can break any rules, you know, and anything goes. I, I would want to be this combination of everything. Something with magical powers that could change, that is immortal, you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 It would be good yeah, for everybody. Yeah, it would be good. Yeah. And uh, what about you yourself? Uh, not Oliver, <laughs> we forget about yeah. him. We talk about Chase. How, okay. how did it all start? Uh, how did your acting career start? Wow. Because we don't know yeah. a lot of things okay. about you. Okay, well, I, I actually, I, I started playing music through high school and in college and I still play music, you know, and then I, I finally got kind of, I wanted to try something different in college other than just playing the band and stuff. So I went over to the local community theater and I started doing community theater and stuff for a while. And that just kept going and kept going and then I went, moved to New York and then I started auditioning in New York, you know, and just one thing after the other and moved to Los Angeles, you know, and then got the originals, so it was just... Yeah. Okay. Does that does that answer your question? You know, it's like, yeah, it was yeah. literally probably about almost ten years ago when I started mm. professionally pursuing. And do you acting. sing also, or do you play? Oh, I do. I sing and I play. In fact, I'll. You I'll have brought, a band? I don't have a band right now. I just play solo. I play with a band for the conventions in, in the U.S. Mm -hmm. for all the creation conventions, wow. and I'm hoping that I might get to play some tomorrow. I brought my guitar. Yeah, we're, we'll so, be there. <laughs> good. Yeah. So hopefully we'll have some time. Maybe I'll bring it for my. The Q and A panel or something. I don't know. So we'll see. It's amazing that the whole cast is uh, playing and music and yeah, singing. Yeah, a lot Kat, of people are. You, yeah, also yeah, Michael. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Amazing. You can include this in the series also. Yeah, we actually did. I mean, just very vaguely in the uh, in the originals. There was a scene where we were around the campfire, and I was just playing some guitar. It was just messing around. It wasn't anything serious, but yeah, yeah. they kind of did a little bit. Kind of integrated. A little bit. That's that's very really nice because yeah, yeah you're multi talented. <laughs> obviously. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, there was something uh, something funny that happened during the, the shooting of the originals. I mean, a funny always, moment. every time it, I'm asked, it's all fun. But so everybody, everybody knows. So you know, Daniel Gillies' character Elijah, and how yeah. Elijah's character is very like not funny, not like clever, and just very, very serious yeah, exactly. all the time. Yes, but he is not like that. He is hilarious and he's clever, and I love him. And we were doing a scene one day. It was quite a few of us. And Steven Kruger who plays Josh on the show. Yeah. He uh, he had like a specific scene and Daniel kept like making him laugh behind the camera, which was hilarious because we were all we were all trying to be serious when the camera was on us, but he kept doing stuff and that's probably what I remember one of the most funniest because then whenever you got like, stuck in your head, even when he's not doing anything or even when he's gone, it's like in your mind you can't get it out of your head and you just keep laughing and oh, keep yeah. laughing. And so that's probably one of the funniest times that I remember mm. on set. Thank you. And uh, in the end, can you please uh, say something to your Bulgarian future fans? Okay. Well, yeah, yeah. I'm really excited for you guys to see the show. I hope you like it. Don't hate Oliver too much. <laughs> He's only doing what he feels is right for the pack. And I hope that you will love him soon enough. And uh, heck, hopefully maybe there's a convention in Bulgaria in the future and I can come see you. That will be fantastic. It will be really great. Yes. Thank you so much. You're very welcome.